How you doing everybody? This is Mike. Um, today I'm coming at you with uh, Alts Executive Cologne number 27. Um, this is a beautiful fragrance uh, for the fall, I mean for the uh, spring and summer. Um, it's supposed to be a clone of uh, Creed Aventus Cologne. Uh, Mike's making a lot of noise. But I digress anyways. This, uh, you know, it has, uh, what's it called? Um, Mandarin in it, uh, musk, uh, pink berries. Um, I think it has birch in it. And uh, this is this is like a citrus. It's like uh, Creed Aventus, but just with citrus. Like if like Versace Pour Homme met, um, what's it called? Uh, Creed Aventus, it would pretty much equal this or the Creed Aventus cologne. You know, this is a very beautiful cologne. You know, it's uh, from all, this is about $49. And uh, for for the price, you get two ounces. I think the one ounce is thirty nine, but I would go with the with the forty nine. This is uh, two ounces, and this stuff smells so good. If you're like starting to sweat and get hot, it just it just projects and projects, you know. So that's uh, for all. The next one is uh, John Varvados Artisan Pure. If you if you're uh, an old fragrance collector the dry down the mid and dry down of this it could remind you of Dolce Gabbana masculine it's been discontinued for a long time but uh that cologne was it, it was a beautiful cologne and this one has pedigree in it uh, I think it's bergamot and uh I heard that John Varvatos uh they went they they discontinued this but you can still find it anywhere between like 30 and like 50 bucks you know for a 4.2 this stuff is awesome. And uh, the last one is uh, Chanel Allure Ohm Sport Oh Extreme. This is great. I, I don't think I'd wear it in like the very, very hot weather. I mean, you can try it, see if, if it works for you. But uh, in the springtime and early fall, this is great. Like this summer, it's, it's, it's gonna be, it, hopefully, I mean, you can try it when it's hot. You know, if it works, this is gonna be awesome for the uh, summer. You know, I would say that between this and Blue de Chanel, I mean, they're totally two different fragrances, but like, um, but they're well made. You know, I'm still waiting for Chanel to drop their new men's fragrance. I heard it was supposed to drop during COVID, but they pushed it. They pushed it ahead. But I can't wait till till their next, their next. Uh, hopefully, it's not a Blue de Chanel elixir or Absolute. But if it's anything like how the uh, Sauvage elixir, then that would be awesome. You know. Savage Elixir, that's awesome for like, for like dates, for like the cold weather, maybe like nighttime during the summer, but uh, yeah, but you guys should give this a try, the uh, the Allure, uh, Chanel Allure Home Sport, you gotta see if it'll focus, this is an Eau de Parfum, it used to be a toilet, uh, toilet concentrate, but uh, this is 100 mil, uh, 3.4 ounce it says over here somewhere. And yeah, right there, 3.4 ounce. And um, yeah, this is, I would definitely t tell you guys to give this a shot, you know. The batch code is right on the bottom, 5001. Yeah, definitely give this a shot. You know, I got mine off Mercari, M-E-R-C-A-R-I. I got this for tax and everything, including shipping. He said he sprayed it a few times, like 98% left. And uh, I got it for about, I think around 80 to 85 dollars, or maybe no, 85 to 90. But usually this this is about 125 to 130 dollars for 100 mil. But I digress. So, anyways, guys, have a great day. Jesus loves you, and keep on with the cologne. Keep sniffing, in a good way, not in drugs. <laughs> anyways, have a good day, guys. All right, bye.